Hello everyone, Atomic Dog here. Um, today I just wanted to discuss a couple of uh, five terabyte Seagate expansion desktop drives I recently purchased. Uh, upon plugging it in, I noticed the performance was really poor. Uh, I have a lot of external USB 3.0 uh, drives and really never saw performance like this. So I had to look into what the problem was and a resolution, but I wanted to show you the performance right out of the box plugged into a Windows 10 machine. <clears throat> this program's called uh, USB Flash Benchmark. Uh, it does a great job of letting you know the performance of your drives. So I'm speeding this up to uh, 32 times speed because it, it really is going to take a long time. In fact, I actually had to stop it early. So here we go, fast motion. Okay, now I want you to notice that <clears throat> as soon as it hit uh, 16K writes, uh, the drive effectively just ground to a halt. Um, as you can see, the write speed was 0.1 megabyte per second at 4K writes. Uh, 2K, it was at 0.05. Uh, it's just totally unacceptable. So the way to fix it is open up your device manager and expand uh, the disk drive section. Highlight your Seagate drive and right click and choose properties. Uh, from there, you're going to click on the Policies tab and change it to Better Performance and Enable Write Caching. Tick that box and simply click OK. Your computer may ask to restart. It may not. But uh, now that this has been changed, I'm going to re-benchmark the drive. This time, I don't need to speed it up. And look at the difference. As you can see, the write speeds are now much more what you would expect to see. In fact, the write speeds are, are very good for an external 3.0 drive. Um, I have a couple smaller ones that perform definitely not as well as this with large writes. And this time, without speeding it up 32 times, the benchmark is complete. So uh, anyway, that's how you fix it. Um, just go into your device manager and uh, make those changes. Now, I do want to comment, though, that I really do not understand what is going on with these Seagate drives. Uh, I'm wondering if it's not some sort of firmware issue. Um, I have not seen this with any other brand of USB drive, whether it's a home build in an enclosure or um, a, a computer. brand, but this is something that Seagate definitely has to address. Um, that type of performance is not only unacceptable, but it's I just don't know how you can sell an external drive and have it perform that poorly out of the box. And users certainly aren't going to be going into settings to try to resolve the issue. Um, anyway, that's uh, my findings and uh, the solution that I uh, that I found. Uh, if you found this helpful, by all means, please hit that like button.